Hey, yo together! And very welcome to the Stuck of Two Crazy Replays! I uh, hope everything is fine. Yeah. Okay, uh, not the best introduction here. I just need to check everything's looking good. Yeah. Oh wow. This is way too loud. I don't know why, the problem is, again, stupid stuff. Still so loud. Interface sounds. Voices. I don't know. I don't care. Yeah. Um, thing is, again, new patch, which means I can't view all the old replays uh, on the normal battle net, so it needs to open another battle net. StarCraft 2 instance, I, I don't know. Uh, which means all the settings are screwed up. It's still so loud. Wow. And now should be better. Okay, so today on Abyssal Reef with a TVP as we have in the bottom right hand side for a new breed, the red Protoss Zars. Oh, what was that? Oh no! Wow, wait, what? Hello? Oh god. Can we please have... What was that? Okay, now it's fixed. What? And in the bottom left hand... Top left hand side, sorry. And the blue is Terra and me, Alex Asher. Yeah, nice. I don't know why, but the decal is not showed as well. Maybe I can fix this too. Where is it? Decal. Gameplay? Alerts, new selection. Uh huh. Uh huh, uh huh. I don't know. It's so strange. Now, if, if, if you have the new instance open for to watch old replays, then it's really bad. Interestingly, now you can learn something. Look how different those buildings are with the circle, with the yellow circle around the warp in. You see that? So with that you already can tell the difference if you're a very skilled player just by moving over which kind of building it is. So you don't even need to click to check for the cybernetics score. You can basically see it. it could be a forge of course but seeing that it's gas it wouldn't make any sense. Uh, and so you can just with scouting and hovering with the mouse over the over the building you can see what's going on here if you're really skilled. You see the Stargate that big it's it's the the distance between the outer yellow circle and the pi uh, the, the warp in itself. Yeah. That's very interesting. So I can't scout anything so far. You don't have music. Why is there no music? What's going on? Come on, so the Reaper dies. What did I see? Uh, not too much, didn't scout the Stargate. Uh, for me it looks like a standard opening so far. Uh, but I got a bunker as I did see the double gateway, so I know something is coming up. And this normally means some kind of stress. The base for SARS is very late. So he needs to, de to find some damage, otherwise this is looking very bad. So here the dance begins. Adats have one range less than marines. There we go with the music. So you could potentially try to kite against them, even though it's really difficult. But yeah, it's... it's The good thing is for Zaz, every damage he can deal on my marines is good damage. So far. Uh, when the oracle comes in, where's the oracle? Oracle? There it is. Uh, breached marines or bruised marines or however you want to call it are more likely to get killed by this oracle because the oracle also have a very high damage versus light 25 here and that's 22 so they can one shot an uh, injured marine as you can see here 23 against 25 bam one shot so this is really good but will he go for it? Uh, take some damage doesn't find anything here might get one uh, not too bad there's the cyclone pew 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 
Let's see. I got through the shields. Dealt some damage to the Oracle, which is nice. Uh, but nothing special here. Oh, Robo Twilight. So he has all the tech available right now. All three tech path. He might get one more, two more SCDs. Not too bad. Maybe even more. Oh, now he's finding damage. Oh, 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 oh. Six kills on this Oracle, which is very good for him. So this Oracle did pay off. And now it's looking better for him, economy-wise. Without this damage, I would be heavily ahead. Uh, I'm still ahead at some point. But meh, we will see how, how this goes, to be honest. Alright then, what's going on here? More gateways maybe? Not quite yet. Maybe going for a Nexus? Not quite yet. Oracle goes in, kills one, maybe one mule, which wouldn't be too big. Wow, floating. Uh, yeah, in Abyssal Reef, we are underwater, so everything which, what, what, everything which, or what? Everything what dies. I think what? I don't know. My English skills are not that high anymore, as I'm not talking too much English currently. But yeah, everything what dies floats up in the Water, uh, not really air, yes, as we are underwater. <clears throat> yeah, music please, come on. So the observer very late, but can go in and scout, there is no turret. I mean there is one turret, but obviously you don't go for the mineral line as you don't want to scout as uh, against Terran. How many SVs there are? You want to see the army, the tech path, the production facilities, the, the eBays potentially. And here we go, Liberator, oh, where's the Mothership Core? <gasps> Not here, so I will get many, many kills, otherwise this Liberator would have dealt no damage at all, staying right on top of the uh, pylon. So where's the Observer? Ah, nice. Ah, oh, Liberator getting no kills so far, but stalling a lot here. Those dog, yeah. <laughs> this is a little, a little sweet spot I got here. Which is really nice. Why is it also? Oh wow. So here we go again. And you see the mining is, is, wow. Sadly I don't have a mining. Uh, oh, don't lose the stalker! Oh no, I, ooh, that was a mistake. So he, he survives. Okay. You should have scouted potentially that the Marines are moving out. There goes another base. Sars is a little bit late with his bases. Um, and overall his game. You can see it in the, in the supplies. It's not really looking too good. But he's getting tech. Splash. Uh, plus one armor. Not looking too bad here. He's a high master league player, so he definitely has some skills available for him to pay off. The marine scouts, everything here, might go for the probe. Doesn't quite get it. And looks like I'm moving out. Yeah, there's the observer. Sees it. Yeah, persevere. So I'm going through the rocks, will take some time, they have high armor, marines dealing almost no damage, only 4 damage each shot. Liberator not helping. The tanks are doing good against this armored structure. However, yeah, yeah, rocks can be a structure. And in StarCraft 2, rocks are considered a structure. Where's the, where's the water person? There it is. Here we go. Pylant cannon. I don't know about the high templar, so those storms could be heavily, heavily good. Ah. Uh, there's the kill. War person still in flying mode, not phasing mode. And there we go. Oh, don't lose everything here. So far, not too bad. The photon overcharges are running out. And now he needs somehow to win this. Uh, otherwise, the space will be toast. So he shades in. Combat shields not ready yet. Not even in, in research. And he goes through. Dodging some storms, not too bad, but all the tanks are now dead because there was nothing to to help them survive. One last attempt to save them. Will it be enough? I don't think so. Adapts are pretty damn good, and yeah, he holds. 
really nice. Where's the world prison now? Where's the world prison? Ah, coming back. Everything coming back. F2 for the win. There we go. And he's getting more gateways now. Up to 7 or 8. 7 so far. Which is fine. Some photon cannons. Not too bad. Maybe a little bit early, he's still only on 49 probes. Although, I'm also just on 53 SEVs, which, uh, well, it's, it's not good, yeah. which is really not good. Still no combat shields, hello. <laughs> this is so bad. There we go, 10 minute combat shield, hype. Okay, here comes the war prison. This, this could deal a lot of damage, which is exactly what he needs. Uh, <laughs> Wouldn't be too bad. Because there's nothing to defend here, not much to defend here. Still no combat shields, which is also bad. Yeah. That's how it is. So there we go. Flying in like a madman, but dealing some damage at least. Which is not too bad. And he always should be able to extract those edits out. No, he shades in, now they are dead. Trapped and dead. They will get some more kills, which is okay. But overall, not too many cities died in this process. Seven were due to the Oracle, I guess. Maybe six to seven. And the other four. Eh. But that's a huge mistake. I should definitely put them back to work. And this war person sh shouldn't stay there. Uh oh. Don't I have any ghosts? There's a ghost academy, okay. Now Sask going for the fourth base. And it looks like I'm trying to drop. Uh, uh, phasing mode again. Transport mode is it called. Oh there we go. This war prison should be so dead. Yep, there we go. That's that's good. That's really nice. Well, what what kind of splash damage is there available? Some salads, okay. Three eye Templar, not too much. He doesn't have much gases. Mm, didn't take those. He need he needs gas. As Protoss, especially you need gas. A stroke, of course, as well, and as Terran sure. But depending on the style you play, you need gas. I mean marines don't don't cost gas. Salads don't cost gas. And circling stone cost gas, so you can be fine with only four gases for a long time, depending on what style you play. But still, then it would be good to have those gases taken. So there we go. Nice feedback. A little bit of stutter step. Sell it. Speed not finished. The charge. Nice kiting. And yeah. Oh, uh, maybe now. Nope. High Templar still survives. And the Marines are toast. Random Scouting Marauder. That was expensive. Oh, there we go. Uh oh. Right on top of this observer. There is feedback. There we go. Nice storm. Uh, those units are dead as well. Good defense so far. So many cannons. Oh my goodness. And now Sars slowly but surely is overcoming me in supply. Going for Tempest, which is interesting considering that I didn't go for any uh, Liberator so far. You know what, I just now realized that my voice was super low because the cable was pushing down the microphone located on my headset which I didn't notice up until now. So excuse me please for the super low voice you might have heard in this cast. It should be fixed now and also should be fixed for the next crazy replays which are coming up. I still hope you were able to understand me. If not, I'm really sorry. But what I don't want to do now is record again. Like re-record. You know? Ah. Time is short, <laughs> especially as a student. <laughs> nah, you know it. And uh, no, I, I'm just lazy, lazy, lazy. Like like the shark. Where's the shark located? Can I zoom out? 
to see the shark. There's a shadow. I don't see the shark. Where is it? Has to be somewhere. There's a big shark. Also lazy, but only shadows. I don't see the big ones. Well, okay. No shark keys for me. 3-3 three, three on the way. Cloak for the ghost. As well as a nuke. Could come handy. Who knows? 8 ghost. Ooh, so many MPs. Wow, 1 with 2 with 3 with 200 energy. Uh, some scans, scouting for bases. Yes, us is up on 5 bases now. While I'm still on 4, could relocate my main base to the 5th base if I wanted to. But it looks like I'm just going for a command center. Interestingly, the 4th base is not a planetary. There's a bunker and a turret, but still, a planetary would be way better. And oh, those ghosts are scouting. So maybe they can do something here. Scouting marine, very important. Three, three, almost done. So I am ahead. One upgrade cycle, and uh, that can be very important. On the other hand, mothership core ready, and oh, that's that's a big one. Nice EMPs, not hitting the High Templar, however. But the tanks dealing so much damage, I don't think I have much energy left. Oh, I'm so wrong. Uh, it's a close fight. Nice storm here. And there are Tempest now, but he doesn't see anything. Yeah, he doesn't see anything. No observer. There are two on the map, but they're coming just in now. Another scan, this observer might die. Which would be bad. The ghost now is spotted. Nuclear launch detected. He should see the ghost. He should see the nuke. The nuke is right here. Will he react or will he stay and fight? It's such a close fight. He doesn't have much left to fall back on. Yes, the nuke! Killing everything! Nuke into win! I would say... Oopsie. What? Sorry. I would say that's GG. Look at the supply. Look at the supply. Only probes left. Not much for him to do. Uh, he could warp in High Templar. There we go. High Templar warped in. Will High Templar be enough to kill this? Or maybe not. You will see the High Templar quite fast. Not as fast as Stimp Marines. That's for sure. Nice feedback. Uh, but there's the big scan. All those High Templar. Dark Templar, sorry, are, are revealed. They don't have to blink. The Shadow Strike. Stride. And there's another scan. With four orbital commands, I can scan all the time. Like, pfft, yeah. Can scan as much as I want. Liberator now, there we go. GG, well played. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. As always, I wish you a very nice day and good bye. Hey, oh there. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support me, simply hit the thumbs up button. Do you have any wishes, feedback, or suggestions? Put them into the comments below. You may also subscribe if you're new to the channel. I wish you a wonderful and stress free day. Take care. Bye bye.